Unlocking Cider, GPT-4, Claude 3, Gemini 1.5 and AI Tools for Chrome. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into the most favorite extensions for the Google Chrome browser in 2023, which include Cider, Chat GPT Sidebar, GPT-4, Claude 3, Gemini 1.5, and AI Tools. Join us as we discuss how to install and utilize these extensions. Let's get started. So open the Chrome Web Store. Next, navigate to the Extensions section and search for this extension. Once you've found it, click Add to Chrome. Then click Add Extension. After the extension has been installed, it's necessary to sign in using our Google account. Excellent! Everything is ready, and now we need to explore and experiment with the various tools available in this extension. As you can observe, there are several options available such as chatting, writing, translating, searching, checking grammar, and more. Let's begin exploring each one individually, starting with the chat option. Here, we're prompting new AI tools in 2024, and as demonstrated, this is the outcome. Let's attempt to condense this result. Simply prompt summarize, and you'll see the summary. Moving on to the next feature, let's explore right. We'll attempt to ask for job and select the email format with a professional tone and medium length. Then, we'll generate the draft, and you'll be able to view the outcome. Let's proceed to the next feature, Translate. Here, we can input the text Welcome to our channel and select the language to translate it from English to various other languages such as Spanish, Chinese, and Arabic. Moving on to the next feature, we have search. Let's attempt a query like best AI tools for coding, and the results will be displayed along with their sources and links. Additionally, there's the OCR option, allowing you to extract text, numbers, and equations from images. We won't test it now, instead, we'll move on to the next feature, grammar. Here, we'll intentionally write something with incorrect grammar. Then, we'll see the wrong words highlighted, click on the continue improving button, and receive the corrections. Moving forward to the next feature, ask, Let's give it a try. Here, we have various types of prompts, including custom prompts, explanations, and more. We'll start by testing the custom prompt. We'll input HTML code to build a login web page, click on the submit button, and receive the generated code. Next, let's try explain code option. We'll copy the returned result and use it as the input prompt, then click on submit and we received an explanation for each tag. Moving forward, we explore the next option, Painter. Here, we can describe the image we want to create. For example, we wrote beautiful butterfly and clicked on the generate button. After a few seconds, we received four generated images. We observe that each image offers multiple options such as downloading, uploading, removing background, replacing background, and more. Let's select the Replace Background option and input Green Background as the prompt. 
After clicking on the Generate button, Oops! We received a green background. Feel free to explore other options as you wish. Moving on to the final option, Chapt, where you can let AI read PDFs for you. You can upload a PDF file and wait until it's fully loaded. Fantastic! Once the file is fully loaded, you can engage in a chat with the AI and request actions such as summarization. Thank you for watching.